Dear Dr. Moon, Excellencies, Ladies and Gentlemen, the Seoul Declaration adopted at the World Summit in February earlier this year and underwritten, supported by so many world leaders, is in fact a very important document. It is a comprehensive, concrete and clear roadmap to a sustainable and peaceful coexistence and ultimate reunification. The strength of the Seoul Declaration lies in the fact that it goes far beyond traditional and narrow military and diplomatic approaches. The declaration indeed is based on UPF's collaborative and multi-sectoral approach and includes many concrete proposals for strengthening people-to-people -people relationships and deepening cooperation. The Seoul Declaration includes so many concrete proposals that could act as stepping stones on the path to improvements in the daily lives of the people concerned and to peaceful reunification. Let us therefore actively promote the content of the Seoul Declaration and ask all all incumbent international leaders to give it the attention it deserves. The peaceful reunification of the Korean Peninsula is more than the legitimate dream of you, Mother Moon, and the entire Korean nation. It is indeed also a crucial task for the entire global community to fulfill.